Good, Good morning, morning Tigers, Tigers and welcome back to TNN. I'm Andre and I'm Gabriel. And let's start with announcements. First off, shout out to Andre over here. It's his birthday today, turning 18. 18. All right, now we'll get to the announcements. Reminded to all student drivers, student parking is not permitted in the parking lot in front of the admin building on the 7th street. This includes the visitor spaces as well as the number spaces. PHS is hosting a virtual open house for the 2021-2022 school year. The virtual open house is open to all current students and parents as well as the incoming freshmen for the 2022-2023 school year. Open house includes presentations from all of the departments and electives offered on campus. So get a head start on balloting for the 2022-2023 school year. A link will be sent through Parent Square on February 17th at 5.30 p.m. So make sure to check it out. FFA week begins on Monday, February 14th and ends Friday, February the 25th. Week 1 will be FFA's dress up days, Monday the 14th will be sports days, Tuesday holiday day, Wednesday hippie versus hillbilly, Thursday celebrity day, and Friday will be alphabet day. Week 2 will have a few FFA events everyone can attend. There is bingo at 3 p.m. in the cafeteria on Tuesday the 22nd. Wednesday will be paint day at 12.15 and dodgeball will be on Thursday the 24th. You will receive an FFA points for each dress up day and events attended. If you have any questions, ask your ag teacher. Hi guys, my name is Miriam Balumbu from the BSU Club, and in honor of this Black History Month, we're going to be reading a poem by Mr. Sykes. The N-word is not the N-word. Born way back in the day, while blacks were owned as slaves, this word was placed up front and given a name. It was used to show divide, it was used to choke the pride, of those respected less than Manji Strays. The N-word is not the N-word. Back in 1863, Lincoln claimed slaves forever free. But it took two years for this to find its truth, but no one gave a thought. Riots broke out and both sides fought. Still a black man's life could not end by tree and news. The N-word is not the N-word. A mere 60 years ago, racism burned aglow. This word was used to keep blacks in their place. Then one man had a dream. He spoke it out loud, let freedom ring. So a bullet came and took his life of grace. The N-word is not the N-word. Today this word is used by many who never knew the hatred and the death it has survived. Simply put, it's not okay to say the word, even with an A. It, is, it disrespects all that gave their lives. And the N-word will never be the N-word. Thank you.